We are here in Hall 10 at HSE and Mrs. Clayton, you're here to talk to me about what you're focusing on this year at the A plus A. Okay, so this year we're very proud uh, as the health and safety executive to be representing Great Britain as the partner country for A plus A trade fair and also at the Congress. It's a really good opportunity for us to showcase the UK health and safety system and to share our learning and our knowledge uh, with, with others who are coming to the fair. Would you say that um, health is the main focus point right now? Yes, indeed. I mean, the, the UK has um, a very enviable track record on safety, um, but um, our statistics and, and uh, statistics across Europe show that health is, is really the big issue that still needs uh, much more effort to tackle. So how have health issues developed in the last couple of years? Okay, well if you look at the statistics, um, we, we uh, come to the conclusion that there are three main health issues that need to be addressed. Um, that's not to mean that other things need to be forgotten, but for us it's musculoskeletal disorders, it's mental health and stress, and it's also occupational lung disease caused through exposures to chemical dust and fumes. Are these problems that are new or have they been around for a long time and how have they become the new focus point? I think um, obviously the, the chemicals exposures have, have been around for, for many, many hundreds of years uh, and, and yet we're still tackling those. Uh, but what we are actually doing is trying to reduce uh, and continue to reduce the exposures and the diseases that are caused by those chemicals exposures. In terms of musculoskeletal disorders and stress, um, we know much more about um, how they're caused and also how you can prevent those in the first place. Uh, and uh, we have really good intelligence sources in the UK so we understand much more about the size and scale of the problem. Part of the complexity of course is that some of those disorders, mental health especially, um, the world of work and, and, and the world outside work uh, overlap and, and so that makes it even more challenging to, uh, to tackle. So we need to work with our partners uh, in the health and safety system to tackle those issues. For the employees, of course, it's something that they are happy that you're working on it, but what about the employers? How do you kind of get them on your side? So we use a number of, of techniques uh, and we try to work with business um, and to work in partnerships. So for occupational lung disease, we've established a healthy lung partnership uh, and it's a group of very senior uh, people in the health and safety system from business, from the trade unions, but also from uh, professional bodies um, who are um, sharing uh, the passion to deal with these issues. And, and we have similar engagement on, on the other health issues too. Uh, and we also work with our uh, colleagues in other government departments as well. Your work is not long done. I'm sure there's a lot more to do and it's great that you're here at the A plus A. Thank you so much and I wish you a great time here as well. Thank you. Thank you very much. I think it's a fabulous show. It's a really good opportunity to uh, talk to colleagues uh, about these issues. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ms. Clayton.